Here at El Maison in West Carrollton, they are open for business using curbside pickup, food truck, and DoorDash for lunch and or dinner. Now, this restaurant has been in the Castro family for 42 years, and the owner tells me that the new service that they're running is not enough to keep the business running as usual. And in the past few days, they've had to lay off about 90% of their employees. El Maison is still serving authentic Spanish dishes, but not in their restaurant that seats up to 450 people. Now they're using their food truck, curbside service, and DoorDash to feed their customers. We can only survive um, for a very short time doing this. We understand people are buying groceries. They are honkering down at home. We're doing everything we can to try to stay ahead. El Maison's owner, Bill Castro, says they're offering a family dinner that feeds four and is seeing some success with that. He says many of the customers they've been getting this week are those that have been coming in for years and are supporting his business both financially and emotionally. People that have grown with us, that have cried with us, that have celebrated birthdays with us, that have buried um, family and, and come to El Mason as a life celebration. They've reached out to us to say, Bill, we're here to support you. And we so much appreciate that and thank them. Liz Moores is one of those customers, picking up food Wednesday afternoon for her grandfather, who she says is staying inside. Since I can't bring him here, I'm bringing them to him uh, just because we still want to support them. It's very important to us that we support the Castro family and uh, this restaurant. And we've been coming here since they were serving pizza, so we love it.